Hello and welcome to Curly Beauty 13. Tiffany here and I am back with a unboxing for a curl kit that I was not expecting to receive today. So today I did an unboxing for Curlbox, which I expected. If you missed that video, I'll link it above and link it below. But right now I'm gonna unbox this curl kit that I guess it was one of them that they missed sending me because I did cancel my curl kit subscription. If you'd like me to make a video on why I canceled my curl kit, please let me know down below and I will let you know exactly why. So let's get this open. And so here's the curl kit. I'm looking in this without even opening the packaging and I already see something that looks like something I have already, maybe two or three. So <sighs> let's just open this up. Okay, first we're going to talk about this Dr. Miracles Shea Butter and Rosemary Length Retention Leave-In Cream. I have three or four of these already. Curl Kit keeps sending these to me. It's a good product. I don't, I can't say I love it, but I don't hate it. So it's something I can use or gift to a family member. That's the first item. Also, there's this Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula pre-shampoo. I think I received something similar to this before as well. Next I see, okay, this seems okay. Um, this is the Curl Keeper Tames Textured Hair Styling Cream. So that's this, it's full size product. This I'm pretty excited to try. I think I've used Curl Keeper before, but they're gel, but it didn't really do anything for me. It wasn't enough hold it was, and it was too crunchy. It was like too hard on my hair, but this I'll try. Next is something in a box it's just a brown box with a barcode I have no idea what this is but we're gonna open it right now but let me get before I open it let me get to the other two items that I can see so this is a tiny I didn't realize what it was eco styler gel it says feel your fantasy it's literally 1.6 ounces and it looks it's a unicorn glitter gel. I don't even know if you can see this. And along with it is an Eco Style. It's not Style or is this Eco Style? Do we always, is it always called Eco Style? Why do we call it Eco Styler? It's called Eco Style. Anyway, Eco Style Enchanting Body Shimmer. It's for your skin to make it glow. Okay. Let's smell this. If I can open this, I'm gonna smell this. Unicorn. Light smell. All right, let's find out what's in this box. This is a Tropical Vacay Luxurious Bath Bomb, three ounces. It smells good. This may or may not have been my last curl box. I don't know. They've been so behind since the pandemic that I'm really not sure where I stand with them. I am officially canceled, but they were behind. So I received this one. I wasn't expecting it at all. It's not horrible. And I would have liked it better if the Dr. Miracles cream was something else in a full size that I've never tried before. They must know that we've received this a lot of times already because they're the ones sending it. That's that. I want to quickly Look at this other curl box I think I opened. I don't know what month it's from. It might have been one that I received after I made my last curl box unboxing in maybe December or November. Hold on. All right, so I'm just gonna quickly go through this curl box. I don't know when it's from at all. Okay, so on the, the package, the bag that comes in the mail, it says what it is. So that one that I just showed you was the December 2020 kit. This one that I'm showing you was October. Anyway, this is what was in the October curl kit. Lot of body, control me edge gel in black. This vitamin E oil from Ampro Pro Style. Now this is a vitamin E oil, but it has other things in it. So it's not just straight vitamin E. Also there's a Sunny Isle leave in not free forever detangler and conditioner. This is not bad. This is a lot of body shine mist. 
this is a lot more stuff than I expected, but some stuff I guess are not full size. Um, it's the Soft Sheen Carshen Optimum Salon Hair Care and La Legend Moisture Remedy Shampoo. And last but not least, Candy Curls Peppermint Co-Wash. So that was what, that's what was in my October curl kit that I received late. So I'm not sure if they owe me any more of them. They, I guess, are keeping their word and sending the ones that we did pay for. But it gets so confusing when it takes so long to receive something. So that was my October curl kit, really late. Um, I probably received it in February or the end of January, just to let you know. That's the end of this unboxing. It was a little extra because I added on that older curl kit, but it's just to show you, if you're interested in curl kit, some of the things that I've received throughout the month. If you like this video and you like unboxings and hauls, please like it, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. I hope to see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.